Hey folks, welcome back to the home show. I'm Dewey. And I'm Eric. Hey, we're back to that same house we started on here, what, a couple weeks ago? When it was warm. Then. Then it got cold. Now really it's cold. warm again. Now it's warm again. Boy, it's nice to have a 45 degree day in the middle of February. It's yes, great. Yes, it is. And I'm sure that the contractors and carpenters are liking that too. Absolutely. They're up there in their t-shirts and getting sunburned in February. It's kind of a nice thing. Kind of a nice thing. You know, when we were talking about engineering and trusses and all that stuff, you know, we've been talking about that a little bit here lately. You know, this house is a, a prime example of so many different things going on in the roof system. Yep. And it's, a, it's a, you know, you got to have engineers and, and nice prints and a good layout. And, you know, and then it comes to setting them, you got to have a good crane operator. And you got to, you know, things really got to happen. And the, and the builder's got to be on, on task with what he's doing, too, you know. Yep. Absolutely. And, uh, and we know it, too, you know, we got to see what's going on out there, and we, we got to come out and make sure everything's working right, you know, so. Yep. You know. And, and that's what we're doing today. We're all at the job site, and we're taking a look at what's going on and showing our viewers what's going on. Absolutely. So that they can kind of see what's expected if they right. do build a house. Absolutely. You know, when you're, when you're building, you know, and you're going to have, well, right here, you got some vaulted trusses here. Then over the garage again, we're going to have some more attic trusses. And then, that's a really big attic truss. That's truss. a big attic truss. That's a big attic truss, absolutely. I think you could probably put four poo tables up on that one. <laughs> one on each end and <laughs> bar in the middle. <laughs> so, you know, when you're out there looking for things, different roof designs, different, you know, you can get tray ceilings built into the trusses. You can get uh, overhangs, big overhangs built into the truss. Little scissors and mono trusses and gables and, you know, it just goes on and on and on. Yeah. It's, uh, it's always interesting. All they have to do is tell us what you want, and we can do it for you. Absolutely, they can. These engineers can can put this on their their programs. They can say, you know, we got to change this. We got to move this a little bit to make this work. And everybody just kind of comes into unison, and it, it all comes together. You know, this house had a, a few changes to be made. You know, with the with the whole thing, and it it was very minimal, but you know, it works out really great. Let's uh, take a peek what it looks like from a different angle. Absolutely, let's do it. All right, we're looking back at it at a different angle. What are we seeing, Eric? We're seeing a, a <laughs> big <hard>. room. <laughs> That's a great room. Look at that thing. It's 22 and, feet wide. Yep, and then you can kind of see all the construction processes on it now. There really ain't a whole lot to it. I mean, it, it's built into your rafters. Basically, it's a floor truss built right into the into the roof truss, and it, it gets you your floor and your roof all in one shot. They set the truss. They nail it down. It's a great thing, you know, and, and like you said, it's really utilizing the the space over the garage efficiently because yep. the the airspace is used up might as well put a room on it and you don't have to do it over your garage only you can you don't do that to. over your any room any room that's right you know and uh, like i said this this house has many different trusses it has the attic trusses it has scissor trusses it has trays in the trusses you know it just it's just a, a really a nice example of what can be done mm -hmm. with house trusses with rafters and, and this, this room here, I'm just still, I'm bum pounding it about it. It's 22 feet long, or wide. Right, and, and that's unheard of. You know, it, a couple of years ago, that was unheard of. Yep, yeah. and it's uh, 24 feet deep, and it's, mm -hmm. God, that's a big room. That's a big room. That's a great room, you know, because now they're going to be able to have, you know, there's going to be a couple uh, bedrooms up there and a bathroom, and uh, it's going to be a nice living quarters when the, when the kids come home, you know, and things like that. So, yeah, so things are moving along out here. Hopefully next time when we come back, the things room. will be looking a lot different. It'll be shingled and who knows what else. Windows are here, <laughs> ready to go in the wall. So remember folks, when you're needing some ideas, prints drawn, whatever, come see us. We'll hook you up. Absolutely. I'm Dewey. And I'm Eric. Thanks for watching.